All right, so we have this, just a little concept work. And we can start anywhere. I'll just start over here in this room and work my way around. The idea here is to take this structure and start making it so it's buildable rather than just this intertwining boxes that are kind of haphazardly strung together. So what I'm doing is here is inserting some edge loops in areas that can support that structure. Okay. And now what I can do is take this out of the equation. Okay. And then I'm going to start building real geometry. So I'm going to take this face and extrude it over. Now, if I wanted to, I could think ahead. Here's this hallway, how it intertwines. So what I'm going to do is take this, extrude it one more time, okay, and quickly jump over to here to extrude it one more time. Okay. Now I have to be a little bit more accurate this phase, so I'm going to insert an edge loop in my orthographic view onto this box. And on a side view, right here. Good. So now all I do is have to knock down some walls. So you can already see that inside the structure it kind of looks like this. I can take this face right here and delete it. Okay, which leaves me in another face on the other wall. And what I could do here is make sure that I got that face cut out. So there's that face. It's cut out. Now I can cut out this face. Now I got buildings that I can kind of string together. And how I do that is I can just merge the vertexes. Get really close, really close. Grab these two objects, combine them. And I can do this in several ways. I can merge the vertices, I can merge the edges. So in this case, let's see, merge edge tool might work, but I want to definitely turn on wireframe on shaded so I could see what needs to be attached. And I don't have to do the last one because uh, connecting three sides equals to the fourth side already solved for me. Okay, so those structures are already put together. I can also eliminate this out of the concept because I can use this to connect those. So, boom. Then jump into my top. Just like that. Insert some edges. I'll start from the top view here. And all these hallways are exactly the same height. So I can get away with doing this. It should work out quite well. Okay. Again, same thing occurs. I take this, you know, I can move it out of the way if I wanted to. And just eliminate the face from here and eliminate the face from here and put these together and then start doing the same thing over and over again until I get a level uh, mesh combine it edit mesh merge edge tool and start merging some of these edges together
All right, so I'm going to finish joining this last room. It's the same as all the other rooms. Then I'll meet you back in the, last, the next video.